It's that time of year. It's time for a run for refugees. This year will be the fifth year in a row that I have run a half a marathon for the Asylum Seeker Resource Centre. I am not an athlete. Look at this body. This is not the body of a runner. So if I can do it, you can do it. Last year, my mom, 63 years young, walked 5Ks. First time she'd ever done it in her life. I started Run for Refugees because I wanted to find a practical and simple way to inspire people to come together as a community to raise money. I did it first time just because I wanted to set myself the challenge of running half a marathon and found all these other, one, other people that wanted to be part of that as well. I've run in a pink tutu, I've run in a wedding dress. This year I'm donning the wedding dress again if I get enough people on board and I'll even get together a whole bridal suite. Three bridesmaids, three grooms, a flower man and a flower woman. And I'm looking for you now. You might be one of them. So join me. Join me to run for refugees. Now in an election year, now when we're up against it, this is the time. And there is such a pride and a joy in running in an ASRC t-shirt, crossing that finish line as you do that last lap around the MCG and go, I have done it. I've done something, I've pushed myself, I've gotten fit, and I've achieved something. And I've also raised money at the most critical time in the history of the Asylum Seeker Resource Center. I've saved lives, I've changed lives by running for refugees. So join me, I'll be so proud for to run by your side this year. Thank you.